Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Y'all ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys. I hope you guys are doing good today. So make sure you guys go on to lovelytea.net or amazon.com forward slash shops forward slash lovely tea for all your tea sipping needs. And also if you're interested in getting an on the go tea bottle, we just got some restock. So definitely make sure you guys check those out as well. So thank you guys so much for the support and stay tuned for the video. All right, you guys, I want to come on here and talk about the whole 50 cent situation with his son, Marquise. So what's going down is this. Basically, earlier today, Marquise took a picture with Supreme McGriff's son. And if you guys don't know, Supreme McGriff used to run with Irv Gotti and Ja Rule and all them back in the day. And 50 Cent had major beef with their crew. And allegedly, Supreme McGriff had a, a hit out on 50 Cent and was wanting to kill him. Um, se Supreme sentencing. Supreme... McGriff's sentencing. Yeah. Um, have you gotten any backlash about your feelings about that? Because he allegedly murdered your mom. Nah. You know that. You know. Check this out. Look. Brain, me and Brain had a relationship. We used to be friends at one point. Worldstarhiphop.com. And then it, it changed. That's how the streets is. Right. You see what I'm saying? Like, but it was funny to hear Irv on the radio talk, like, talk about about Brain and, and and saying that he's, you know. Want to like want to end it because he got life. You know what I'm saying? He don't want to sit around in the pens. He's ready to die. He don't don't do that, man. He gonna hang up. He, he sounds like weak, like a weak person. Mm. You see what I'm saying? And then Earl should be smart enough not to say that, even if that's what he really is. You right. see what I'm saying? Right. You know, but he sounds like the weak guy that I thought he was. Yeah. You know, under those circumstances, and even when it's, it's almost like even mm. after. Okay, you got life in the penitentiary. What do you, what do you want to like? What do you want to die for? Now you should live in the penitentiary so your name lives. Mm. You see what I'm saying? Right. Live up to your name. See the difference is no, your reputation doesn't mean anything because everybody there is like you. Wow. When you hit the max, you see what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. it, it's nothing. Their reputation. Now you got to be what you were on the street, but yourself. See, everybody that was there that did everything was an outsider that was paid to do it. Mm. It wasn't him. Mm. You see how he's weak? It looks, you, some people really look strong, and it's their influence mm -hmm. that's really strong. And so 50 Cent's son, Marquise, was in a picture with him. And so when 50 Cent saw this, he was not feeling that shit at all. He went to the picture and he basically said, if both of these little niggas got hit by a bus, he wouldn't have a bad day. I want you guys to go ahead and check this out, and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. All right, so you guys just saw what 50 Cent had to say. When I tell you right now, social media is going crazy behind this picture and behind what 50 Cent had to say. A lot of folks are really mixed. Some folks are saying 50 Cent is a horrible father. Like other folks are saying that his son took it too far. You know, you should never troll your father like this. So it's really interesting how people are feeling on social media. I want you guys to go ahead and try out these tweets, these comments, and what folks had to say. Check this out, and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. <music> Alright, so you guys just saw the comments and the tweets. You know, my personal opinion is this. I definitely think that 50 Cent is in the wrong. At the end of the day, that's your child. And you're basically laughing at your child potentially losing his life 
if he was to get hit by a bus. There's nothing funny about that. At the end of the day, that's your seed. And it's really sad to see how far their relationship has fractured over the years. They've been beefing for a long time, but it's just gotten worse and worse to the point now this is just really sad. I also think that Marquise, even if him and Supreme McGriff's son are cool, I hope it's on some genuine shit and he didn't do that just to piss his father off. You know what I'm saying? Because it just looks shady that you would take a picture with the son of the man who tried to kill your father. And not only your father, but also your paternal grandmother. There's also rumors that Supreme put a hit on 50 Cent's mother. So this beef between them definitely runs deep. And I think that what Marquise is doing is not okay. They're both being extremely petty right now. You know, and I feel like that's a bit much. At the end of the day, that's your father. And even if he wanted to take a picture with him, they could have kept it off his social media and just been cool behind the scenes. He knew what that would do. He knew what that would imply. So I just find this whole situation just really distasteful. I think at the end of the day, it's just gone on too far. I think both of these men, because his son is now a man, okay? He's over the age of 18. I think they both seriously need some counseling and they need to figure out what the issue is that has caused such a breakdown in the relationship. Marquise is grown now and granted his mother might have planted some seeds in his head but I think that the issue is a lot deeper because this is not normal. It's not normal to wish death on your estranged child and it's not normal to take pictures with the son of the man who wanted to kill your father. You know at the end of the day when I look at this whole back and forth between them it's just sad. But then let's also not forget that 50 Cent is the king of trolling and that he's disrespected his son time and time again and I think it's just gone to the point now where his son just does not care. He doesn't care about 50 Cent's feelings. He doesn't care what he has to say. He's going to do him and that's it. So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire disturbing story concerning Marquise and Supreme McGriff's son hanging out and taking a picture and 50 Cent basically saying that if both of them got hit by a bus, he wouldn't give a shit. So let me know whose side are you on with this? Do you think his son is foul for doing this and posing with this young man? Or do you feel like 50 Cent is foul for saying what he said? Or do you feel like they're both in the wrong, okay? So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. <laughs> hey, you guys, it's your girl T, and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.